So hello to all of you, wherever you may be, from the Juventus Stadium in the Alpine city of Turin. Juventus against Roma. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Things have got underway here pretty promptly. So, Jim, tell me this. Who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah. Aidan Dzeko, he's a real handful up front, Peter, and not just because of his height and that physical presence, he's got excellent awareness and, and technique, and that allows him to bring others into the game. He's a very powerful finisher too, so he'll be giving defenders a real dilemma about whether to close him down or not. I would advise the former. Hard to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. Pellegrini... Is the guilty party there? Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. And they've been given a corner. Well, it was a hefty deflection, but he's claiming it. <laughs> Juventus take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Just brushed off the ball there. Douglas Costa has a look up from the right-hand side, seeking out options. Higuain. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Matuidi. Battles to win it back. Bentancur. Ramsey goes looking. Mukatari. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And it's Dzeko. They're two with a long pass out wide. Mukatarian looking to get on the end of this. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Queen played out to the wing. Cristiano Ronaldo going through. Trap. He's gone for it. In for the pieces. It's a carbon copy of their previous miss. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually quite good. Great leap. Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. First 45 minutes are up. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball, the passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Juventus head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. Already up and running for the second half. Hits one! Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. 
Alexandro picks it up from the goal kick. Ramsey. Matuidi. And it's Douglas Costa. Has a swing at it! No, not this time. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Pastore. Tries a through ball. Cristiano Ronaldo. Higuain shoots! He's missed, but not by that far. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Under. So what's he planning here? Decent progress down the left. Looks to slip it through. It's Iguain! Oh, surely that deserved better. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Oh, he really wanted that. Higuain, very nearly making something happen there. You can't keep a good man down. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. He's got away. Lovely little display of skill, that is. Roma showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Jim, there's not too much subtlety. Can he score? Big relief, it just needed better contact. Roma really have been deserted by their composure and allowed frustration to take over, and it's not a good sign. There too. Pellegrini. Come back to the keeper. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. And it's Matuidi. It's one! Oh, just couldn't quite turn it in. Well, the hold-up play as that move was being constructed was important for the runners, and more really should have been made of it. It so nearly came off for him. Yeah, he's been at the centre of... Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Juventus, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. And there's a lot more to read into this game than just the scoreline.